Welcome to a truly practical offer on the Virtual Linguistics Campus, the repository VLC 105 Phonetics, Phonology and Transcription, a collection of e-learning units about general phonetics, the phonology of present-day English, and phonetic transcription. The repository is full of material and data ready for analysis or for in-class use. To make the content as accessible as possible, VLC 105 uses several interactive multimedia options. Here are some examples. We use interactive diagrams and images. We have integrated sound samples wherever suitable. This is an example of breathy voice. How? Boy. We have many interactive charts that not only describe but also show articulation phenomena. Uh, uh. We use sound and visual illustrations in many ways. The north wind and the sun were disputing which was the strongest. And the highlight are our interactive sound charts T. of the languages represented in VLC 105. Join us on the Virtual Linguistics Campus and make use of the VLC 105 options that provide you with the background knowledge that is necessary for further studies Red. in linguistics. The whole course is basic. There are no further prerequisites for VLC 105 enrollment. But let's now see how you can use VLC 105. If you have an account on the OER VLC website, which is of course free, accessing the repository is simple. Just log in with your personal data and you will find the repository on your personalized dashboard or in your course overview. A click on the bottom of the VLC 105 tile leads you to the repository start site where you have access to all modules starting with the content description and the preliminary section with advice and help on how to use the units. And here is how we organize the content of VLC 105 for you. Part 1 looks at the central topics in phonetics, speech anatomy, consonants and vowels, and suprasegmental features. This part makes you fit for all other topics of VLC 105. Part 2 first defines the principles of phonology and then discusses the necessity and use of phonetic transcription, including a historical overview. Part 3 is dedicated to present-day English. We will look at the sound systems of the two main phonological varieties of present-day English, that is, received pronunciation and North American English first, and will then move on and deal with the principles of transcribing data in these varieties. This includes a detailed discussion of connected speech aspects such as weakening, assimilation, etc., and suprasegmental effects, for example, stress and tonal effects in present-day English. This part is full of sound data to illustrate each of these effects. It ends with an overview of the phonological varieties of English, a topic that is dealt with in detail in a separate VLC repository. The final part is language specific. In VLC 105, it aims at German EFL teachers, English as a foreign language. To teach English pronunciation, they need to understand their own sound system. They have to analyze typical pronunciation errors and provide remedial action. Further variants of VLC 105 focus on Spanish and Arabic EFL teachers. This list of units is being updated and quality assured on a regular basis. And our teaching and learning concept? Well, studying online on the Virtual Linguistics Campus simply means go through each unit at your own pace, tick off an activity you have worked through, and make use of as many VLC options as possible. And if you don't know what to do first, well, then use the how to proceed options at the beginning of each content section. And as most of you know, each unit should be finished with a mastery test 
where you can earn your personal topic-related VLC badge. And at the end, if your score is 70% or higher, you will be awarded the Statement of Accomplishment Certificate for this course. Maybe you prefer using your mobile device. If so, feel free to download the Moodle app, log in and study where and whenever you want. Well, that's it. The rest is up to you. Thanks for your attention and see you on the Virtual Linguistics app.